Ladies and gentlemen, the Pokemon Go Tour Hoenn has been announced and it's gonna be crazy. I don't even know where to start, there's so much going on. There's actually gonna be two versions of this Go Tour event. A global and free version of this event is going down on February 25th and February 26th from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. on each day. And there's gonna be a live event location with a ticketed version that's gonna cost about 25 USD. This is actually gonna be going down the weekend before the global event on February 18th and February 19th. And it's going down in Las Vegas, Nevada. No way, the Pokemon Go Tour Las Vegas. This is gonna be wild. We have a lot to get into, so let's get into the global version first. The Primal Surge. Primal Kyogre and Primal Groudon are officially coming to Pokemon Go. You can encounter their Primal Reversion forms for the first time in Pokemon Go and experience the true nature of their power. I can't believe they're actually coming to Pokemon Go. If you guys wanna learn more about Primal Kyogre, check out this video I did. And if you wanna learn more about Primal Groudon, check out this video I did. Little deep dive on the stats of these Primal Pokemon and how incredibly awesome they're going to be. During the Go Tour, they're actually gonna be in their own brand new Primal Raid. So the following Pokemon are gonna be appearing in Raids. In one star Raids, we have the Gen 3 starters, Trico, Torchic, and Mudkip, all shiny eligible. In five star Raids, we have all of the Deoxys forms, all of them being shiny eligible. So that's gonna be exciting. If you wanna get some Deoxys, there you go. And finally, in the all new Primal Raids, Primal Kyogre and Primal Groudon are going to be available to Raid. It's probably fair to assume that we're just gonna be getting energy from these Raids to turn our Kyogres and Groudon into their primal version. We're gonna have some special research called Chasing Legends in which we're gonna be researching the red and blue orbs, which are the items that have the connection to Primal Kyogre and Primal Groudon in Pokemon Go. It's going down, it's happening. Also in pretty plain text here, it just says, your chance to encounter Pokemon first discovered in the Hoenn region, new shiny Pokemon discovered. Is that shiny Jirachi? It just plainly says that, okay. So we're getting shiny Jirachi. It's a beautiful shiny. It's kind of the theme of this entire season. Season, so we were expecting that, but that's awesome. Special Pokemon are gonna be appearing in the wild. We've got a lot of new shiny Pokemon here, very exciting. In the Sands Habitat, we have Torchic, Nincada, Cacnea, and Bagon. Cacnea is a brand new shiny that's gonna be coming to Pokemon Go. Love that. In the Mist Habitat, we're gonna have Surskit, Meditite, Chimeco, and Absol. Surskit, a brand new shiny coming to Pokemon Go. Heck yeah, I love it. In the Earth Habitat, Trico, Wurmpool, Mawile, and Gulpin. Gulpin shiny is finally gonna come to Pokemon Go. Another one. And in the Shores Habitat, we're gonna have have Mudkip, Lilip, Feebas, and Clamperl. No new shiny Pokemon there. I don't know why. Maybe they forgot to include it. One second, I didn't even notice this. If you take a look at the text right there at the top, it shows the new shiny Pokemon that we're gonna be getting. Shiny Unknown H, Shiny Surskit, Shiny Gulpin, Shiny Torkoal, a new regional shiny, Shiny Cacnea, Shiny Tropius, a new regional shiny, and Shiny Relicant. That's not even half of the news, and I'm already okay with it. I'm already satisfied. In eggs during the event, in two kilometer eggs, we have Pichu, Eglipuff, Trico, Torchic, Mudkip, Azrael, and Wine. Not, nothing crazy. Five kilometer eggs, Surskit, Gulpin, and Cacnea. So if you want some of those brand new shinies, they're gonna be available in five kilometer eggs. It's a great opportunity to get them. Seven kilometer eggs are gonna be Trapinch, Feebas, Bagon, and Beldum. At the greatest pool, not bad though, not bad. And the 10 kilometer eggs, Torkoal, Tropius, and Relicant. If you're trying to get the brand new regional shinies, it looks like these are gonna be the only Pokemon in that pool. So a perfect chance to get a good one or a shiny. Go, go, go. It also mentions there's gonna be new features and items. Check back soon for additional info. So we're gonna be getting some new features and items. I don't know what that's gonna be. Okay, that was a lot. Now, let's talk about the in-person live event at Las Vegas, which again, will be a paid event. Teaming up with Team Go Rocket, a special research story only available to ticket holders is coming to Las Vegas. Ever wonder what it's like to team up with Team Go Rocket? I don't know what that means. I don't know what the lore of this story is or what's gonna go down. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. That's interesting. What, what does that mean? Shining surprises. This pretty much is telling us there's gonna be an increased chance of encountering shiny Pokemon during this event. So that's gonna be be awesome. And then of course we have the Primal Surges, which I still can't believe. Primal Kyogre and Groudon are actually coming. That's gonna be insane. There's gonna be five star raids with all the Deoxys forms, and then of course the Primal Raids as well. We're also gonna get all the same spawns that are gonna be happening at the Global Go Fest, and also the same eggs that you're gonna be getting at the Global Go Fest. Some other exclusive experiences, legendary photo opportunities. If you take a snapshot, I believe you're gonna be getting Latios and Latias encounters. I'm totally down for that. Timed research, a go for a spin. Complete time research for encounters with Spinda. That's a great rare shiny I'm down. Field research. Collect mega energy and catch ghost type Pokemon with new field research tasks. Trainers with a ticket will have a boosted chance of receiving this research. New research task? Is that going to be a new feature? And here are all the bonuses for ticket holders. You're going to get an increased chance of encountering shiny Pokemon. Up to six special trades per day. Half Stardust cost for trades within the park. Half hash distance. Up to nine free daily raid passes by spinning gyms. Team Go Rocket will appear more frequently in balloons and an incense will last 90 minutes. I know that 
one ticketed event is a little bit expensive. I get that. I don't know if it's necessarily that worth it. Obviously, I'll be there. I'll cover it. I'll enjoy it. But $25 worth, but it seems like you're getting a lot of the same stuff that you get during the global one. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comments down below. I'm excited about it either way. We have so much going on. This is going to be coming up soon. Just a few months. I cannot wait.